If you're a big swim team and you like to order a lot of gear, maybe you ought to check out Swim Outlet Team Division for these reasons. Swim teams receive a 10% discount on bulk orders. Swim teams or organizations get an 8% commission on referred sales. You'll also like their customization services, which is affordable and available at all times during the year for all team gear. With over 50,000 items in stock, you can get most anything you want. Swim Outlet Team Division. You need to try it out. This is the Morning Swim Show for Tuesday, August 13th, 2013. I'm Tiffany Elias. In today's show, Jeff Cummings takes us back to Barcelona once more to meet with one of the United States breakout swimmers who was a member of the men's gold medal 800 free relay, Charlie Houchin. Here's what he had to say. So, Charlie, thanks for joining us. Uh, gold medal in the 800 free relay. Congratulations on that. I appreciate it. Thank you. So, it must have been a good feeling to uh, walk out in a big world championship final. You know, it, it was um, to get to walk out uh, with Ricky, Connor, and Brian was, uh, was special. And uh, it, if anything, it was just empowering to be with those guys. So, you weren't nervous at all about this being your first big international final you know I really wasn't I would, may, may have been a little nervous um, in the morning relay um, but at night it was it really was just fun and I, I just remember thinking to myself there's no way that uh, that I'll go I'll go at least what I went this morning like how could I not swimming with these guys so that prelim relay there was pretty much you know a big battle for those two spots that were going to be in the final how did that motivate you to swim fast in the morning um, you know, I think I just I did a good job, a better job this year as opposed to say last year of executing my personal race strategy. Uh, you're totally in the moment with the team, uh, with, with the other three guys. Um, but if you don't go back to what you know and do best, once you hit the water and you're executing your part of the team effort, um, you can kind of get lost. Right. And so I think I just did a good job of kind of executing what I've always done. And 145.6, I'm going to be really excited about that. I know it was a relay start, but I mean, your best time by a second. Yeah, when I, when I hit the wall, I couldn't tell how well it was, um, just because when it's a relay start, it's always a little different yeah. and uh, a little more exciting, more nerves because of a relay, I guess, more adrenaline. Um, and uh, Clee is, Michael Clee is, uh, he's probably the best with numbers uh, that I've ever met on Team USA. And he had my split, he had already calculated my split in his head and he was like, you know, don't quote me, but I think you were 45, five, five I think you said just now, I think it was 45, six. So it was, uh, it was exciting. Yeah, so that, it's, you know, you're probably thinking, wish I had done a flat start so you can get an official time. Um, you know, I met without the uh, the other three guys and the adrenaline of the relay, maybe not have gone as fast. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'll take the I'll take the role in the 45 mid right now. So this is not your first World Championships. You were here, uh, not here, in Shanghai at the Worlds in, in 2011, swam the 400 free. Um, how have you, as a swimmer, grown in those two years? Um, well, this time around, uh, only doing the relay, as opposed to uh, the individual, the 400. Um, it was nice this time getting to see the first five days of the meet um, instead of swimming the 400, which is usually that first day. Yeah. Um, and so I got to, uh, you know, absorb what the other what the other guys and the other girls were doing a little bit more. Um, but I think just with time and with uh, participation, at the very least, at this level um, that I've gotten used to, um, I've learned how to stay within control of what I can do mm -hmm. um, while all you know the chaos of one of these big meets the international swimmers the moving to and from the hotel all of that's going on you can still kind of stay in the zone and do what you need to do so as I said it was the second faster than you've ever swum in your life uh, what do you attribute that to the training you were doing back at Jacksonville with Sergio Sergio Lopez you know uh, the last two years I've had a great time with Sergio uh, training at bowls I've learned a lot from him um, he's gotten to share a lot with me, um, just soaking everything in. His experiences as an athlete, his experiences as, as a coach, um, it, it has just been really a, a blessing moving from uh, training with Sean, which was incredible, to training with Sergio now, um, and just always viewing it as a, a progression in your career. Um, it, it's been a great thing. His mindset for the sport is, uh, it is really, second to none uh, of the coaching lines in the sport right now. So how do you take this experience in Barcelona and move forward in your swimming career? 
Um, I think specifically I was really happy with the, the effort itself on the relay, the two efforts, and um, I'm going to use that. I think it's a, it's a great jumping off point for the, the individual 200 and the other relays moving forward. Um, but really the best part is just the relationships. Um, knowing how to capitalize or learning how to capitalize on the relationships that you that you either improve upon at these meets or, or you make new ones um, is really the best part and if if you're not finding ways to take advantage of these great relationships with these great athletes um, then you're missing out on the best part All right well i'm sure there's a lot that you have to soak up now we're here on the last day it's right. probably you're probably relieved are you going home right away or are you staying here for a little bit uh yeah i'm taking the the flight out with the majority of the team in the morning <laughs> it's going to be good to get back in the states i'm sure it, it will uh this is a great city and i know everybody's enjoyed being here well charlie congratulations on the gold medal we're looking forward to uh seeing how you continue to do in the future i appreciate it thanks Jeff. thanks it's always great to listen to breakout athletes such as Charlie Houchin. All right, Jeff will be back in the chair tomorrow interviewing more great guests on the Morning Swim Show. That's it for today's show. I'm Tiffany Elias. Thanks for watching.